Bishop Santos Lino Wanok has been installed as the fourth and new bishop of the Northern Catholic Diocese in Liram since the diocese was established in 1968. Bishop Santos Lino Wanok, who has been the bishop of Nebi Diocese since 2011, will be replacing Bishop Joseph Frazelli, who has clocked the mandatory 75-year age for retirement as a bishop. <laughs> The colorful ceremony held under the scorching sun at the parish grounds in Lira town was presided over by the Archbishop of Gulu Archdiocese, John Baptist Odama, and it attracted several hundreds of Catholic faithful from Lira, Nebi, and neighboring districts. <laughs> President Yoweri Kaguta Museveni, in a speech read for him by the Vice President Edward Jonka Sekandi, congratulated Bishop Santos upon his appointment as the Bishop of Lira Diocese and pledged government support in working together towards the improvement of the well being of the people of in the diocese. Gone are the days when the churches in Africa had to look up for foreign well wishers for funding. We therefore need to work hard to make our churches economically self-reliant. But self-reliance principle cannot be attained when the bulk of the flock is still living in poverty. We therefore have no alternative other than working hard to initiate and implement income generating projects at our household levels. We must transform from present practices to commercial. The church is urged continue guiding people against negative cultural and uh, suspicious practices such as witchcraft, charge and sacrifice, and other forms of undevelopment and harmful beliefs. The president acknowledged the work of the church in Lira in the area of education, health and economic development and ask the church to continue sensitizing the community against corruption by teaching especially the youth to be honest, responsible, and accountable for the country to raise a generation that values integrity and hard work. The president, who pledged a vehicle to the new bishop to facilitate his movement, also commended the Church of Northern Uganda for supporting government efforts in promoting peace and reconciliation in Northern Uganda. He also reminded the people of Lira to maintain peace and security, saying the NM government shall remain focused on defending people's safety and individual freedoms. Bishop Santos appreciated the support and the leadership that his predecessor, Bishop Frazelli, gave to the diocese and wished him best of the luck in his retirement. Archbishop Odama called upon the faithful in the diocese to support the new bishop, saying the divine calling has its own challenges but the leadership will always rely on spiritual and the physical support of the members. The function was attended by the State Minister for Lands, Betty Amongi Ongom for Northern Uganda, Grace Kwichini, the Bishop of Arua Diocese, Reverend Sabino Odoki Ochan, and several members of parliament and local leaders from the neighboring districts. Reporting for you, Stephen Kanakulia Sempa. <laughs>